Citizen Television. Welcome to another episode of the Planetary Persuader. I am Cosmic Kev, your host, and this week's episode is for November 8th through the 15th, 2013. So hey, you know what? We had a saying back in the 70s. They made everybody drive slower as 55 saves lives. I was just about to get my license when that happened. As a kid, you know, and you want to go really fast, you know, but I'm turning 55. <laughs> oh, boy. Well, anyhow, what do we got going on this week, folks? We've got, um, the good news is, is we've got Mercury going direct on Sunday afternoon, direct in Scorpio at about, uh, I guess, about 12 degrees, 2 degrees Scorpio at um, 112 what else we have well we've got Venus is in Capricorn Jupiter's now retrograde so it's going backwards in Cancer Mars of course is in Virgo Saturn moving on in Scorpio we've got a retrograde Uranus in Aries a we have Neptune going direct this week though um, it was retrograde but uh, Neptune goes station direct on Wednesday the 13th and um, Pluto is carrying on direct in Capricorn and of course North Node in Scorpio all right then Saturn in Scorpio too yes yes indeedy <clears throat> so what can I say about this week? Well, when we get to the, the the latter half of Scorpio is more about faith. The latter half of Scorpio has more to do with philosophy and transcendence and mysticism. And there's an incredible amount of creative juice. We've got to remember that. Scorpio's key phrase is, I create. And, you know, the kind of creativity that we see in Libra has a lot more to do with harmonizing elements. But Scorpio's type of creativity, it deals with our aspirations, our fears, our greatest fantasies. <clears throat> and um, these things tend to trigger emotions, which I think great art triggers the emotions. You know, if there, or at least it, it creates a thought process in the mind, but beyond just mental stimulation, when something appeals to your emotions, it gets you in a much deeper place. <clears throat> and, you know, with Neptune in Pisces, Chiron in Pisces, Jupiter in Cancer, water sign consciousness is big right now. Water sign consciousness is about how we empathize with one another, how we feel for one another, how we make family and tribe with one another and how we sense when, when one another is doing well or in pain or what and having that kind of psychic sense it goes beyond the internet it goes beyond cell phones this is something that our ancestors had to use we had to sense when something was wrong we responded to those senses and i think in this scorpio period in the latter part let's return to those more primal senses about ourselves it's like i'm sensitive to you you're sensitive to me we're going to have good things happening together with each other. If we're just insensitive and not resonating with one another, um, we're going to blow it. It's simple as that. So, 
Shall we journey together, sign by sign, as we go through the horoscopes in this uh, week's episode of Planetary Persuasion?